a YouTuber. YouTubers are known for doing some of the craziest survival challenges of all time. I survived being buried alive. I survived 24 hours in the Bermuda Triangle. I survived 50 hours in 2D. Well, today, I'm taking it up a notch. The biggest I survived challenge this platform has ever seen. That's right. I survived 24 hours. Straight. Now, you might be wondering, Hey Ryan, isn't that just a, a vlog? No, this is big. This is this is viral. This is a viral video. It's a conceptual banger. You might notice that today resembles a lot of my past day in my life videos, which is... <laughs> I'm gonna go run four miles. However, here's the here's the challenge. Here's the survi survival thing. A cold front just blew through Texas like two days ago, so now it's cold outside. It's colder outside. I think it's 49 degrees right now. Fahrenheit. Pretty harsh conditions. Yeah, it might be raining as well, so <laughs> I am pretty tough. Here are my fun drinks. Look at the upgrades. We, this is a big deal. We've got a water jug. I mean, this is fancy. Look at this. Look at that. It's got a straw. <laughs> got this fancy stainless steel, you know, for coffee. Protein shake. Easy. Let's get in this work and let's not just survive, but thrive. <laughs> That's right, hour two. We are absolutely destroying this challenge, but now it's time to run. <laughs> All right, guys, pretty cold out here. What do you guys think? Barely surviving. Zach ran 10 miles on Saturday. I just wanted to pass everybody. <laughs> Got it, that's the move, guys, so just do that. What do you guys think about my method of running 40 miles one week and then zero the next week? <laughs> High IQ or low IQ, I can't tell. <laughs> No mid, no mid IQ. All right, mile one complete. Yeah, pretty pretty comfortable pace here. Just kind of out and about, pretty cold. All right, guys, this actually might be my biggest threat for the day. <laughs> oh, these guys are scary. Oh, no. Uh, good morning. Good morning. Oh, no, they're running. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> <laughs> mile two. Literally same conditions, feeling pretty good. Kind of just having conversation at this point. Mile three is where it got crazy. I'm just kidding. It's still very relaxed. Check the heart rate. Oh, oh. yeah, he survived. I'm filming this as a joke, but now I don't know how to stop joking about it. I don't know what I'm doing in the next clip, but I'm just gonna make sure that it's serious. So. Oh, yes. I'm sorry, that was so dramatic. My eyebrows pretty much look the same. Maybe I should start telling them, hey, just take them off. Go crazy. Get wild. <laughs> They're not noticeable anyway. I don't know why, but now when I make vlogs, I just feel the need to get my eyebrows waxed. It just seems, it seems, I was gonna say appropriate. It's not. Look at this guy. Aw. Spock got a haircut. Spock, I got eyebrows waxed. He's not too excited about it. Spock, you look cute. Dude, he's really tucked in there. Anyways, I made these in the microwave for lunch. They're like pot stickers. So good. Also, Haley and I's anniversary was recently, and she got me this. Look at that. It's like a tiny ecosystem. Look at this. That moss is real. It literally is living in there. I've been obsessed with that stuff. I've been I've been so obsessed with it. My favorite color is green. Coincidence? I notice I feel better when I drink water. Anyways, the weather today is stinky. This is stinky weather. I love when it gets cold in Texas, but I really like cold when it's not raining. Whenever it's cold and raining, I feel like I'm I'm in London. Because that's the only place that I'm aware of that is cold and rainy. Now, I love London. Don't get me wrong, I love it. But here in Texas, we don't have beautiful 700-year-old buildings to revel at and to tuck away into. Mm. Yo, these pot stickers. Oh, now I got Spock's attention. Look at him, he's coming. Look at him. What do you want, Spock? I thought you were taking a nap. You little rascal. You can't eat these. Guys, I'm gonna chow down on these pot stickers and then I'm gonna go play Ultimate Frisbee in mud. <laughs> Welcome to my crazy life. Anyways. Haley, will you hold this real quick? All right, so we're playing Ultimate Frisbee. Yeah. Check this, watch this. Yeah, we're done. We're done with weddings now. We like to play Ultimate Frisbee all the time. Thanks, Haley. So. However, I'm very excited. You guys saw in my last vlog, I'm sponsored by Celsius, which is kind of nuts. You guys know Celsius? Yeah. 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 Yes. Like what if I told you guys they're launching a new flavor? No! <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna give you guys all one blind taste test. Tell me what you think, okay? This is the flavor. Lemon lime. I love lemon lime. I haven't tried it yet, so I'm gonna try it real quick. <laughs> oh, that's good. <laughs> that's good. Thanks. Thanks, Karin. 
On three. One, two, three. <laughs> It takes me back to being a child, and I was selling lemonade on the street, actually. It's so good. It's so, so good. good. This is a brand new flavor. Uh, we're getting energized right before Ultimate Frisbee. Now, this is a fun drink. <laughs> we love Celsius. So I'm actually pretty bad at Ultimate Frisbee. I do enjoy it a lot. It's a good exercise. Look at that lockdown defense, though. Come on. If there are any recruits watching this video that are looking to recruit, you know, uh, uh, six foot four, 225 pound beast uh, I'm definitely not your guy but you know what who's having the most fun I think that's the real the real winners who's having the most fun is that I think that's how they measure that so if you haven't tried it try to play ultimate frisbee it's super it's a good time I love it survive this case. did you just say what I think you said she likes me <laughs> I got a margarita pizza as you can see a lot of vegetables on the plate I'm very veggie oriented Haley what is that hey Haley Haley I'm gonna eat those veggies I'm gonna eat those what a day <laughs> today was jam-packed but it was really good by the way I played really bad today in ultimate frisbee I gave up like eight touchdowns <laughs> Yeah, the only reason I didn't get cut from my team is because I'm pretty much the one that tries to organize this thing. So, um, not sure if they're allowed to. <laughs> no, they could. They could if they want. I was close to getting cut. I love days like these. Good times, good friends. I always get super reflective at nighttime. And that's because I'm trying to be re more reflective at nighttime. It's a choice. I don't know about you guys, but I feel like I have a really hard time, like, remembering my life and being present so what i've started doing you can barely see it but i started like taking photos throughout the day i didn't really get everything but i'm <laughs> why am i so obnoxious i just i did i literally played so bad i'm just trying to document my days more honestly i've been done with this for like an hour i'm actually just watching american football <laughs> i'm not even sure if i'm allowed to show that so anyways, right now I'm super excited. I'm working on three more main channel videos for the rest of the year. And as you guys know, this is my secret channel, so don't tell any money. <laughs> but anyways, secret channel, uh, what can I call you guys? Secret channel Voyagers, I appreciate you guys so much. This is a great outlet for me creatively, emotionally, <laughs> mentally. <laughs> I know the title of this video, but hey, seriously, I know how hard it can be to get through a day. So give yourself a pat on the back and have a fun drink. Treat yourself to that. Find the little joys in life, you know? What, I feel like I'm giving a speech at a graduation. I'm sorry. <laughs> I seriously appreciate you guys so much. I love you guys. Hope you guys have a great week. Say howdy to somebody. Anyways, I'm done. My speech is over. Howdy. I just said howdy as a departure. I'm turning off this phone before you make me turn off my phone. <laughs>